you know, as we get closer to summer, many students will be out there looking for summer jobs, maybe an internship. We want to talk now about Summer Works. It's a program offered by Multnomah County to connect businesses with teens and young adults looking for those opportunities. <laughs> so pleased to have in studio Commissioner Loretta Smith with us this morning. Tell us about this program. Yes, ma'am. So nice to see <laughs> you. Now, Summer see Works, you. we hadn't heard the name before. Can right. you explain what it is? Summer Works is a partnership with Work Systems where um, you partner with businesses or local governments and you put kids in your departments and give them an experience and so it is a huge hit we started partnering with work systems 11 2011 and now we pay for we started with 25 kids and now we have 500 kids wow. that oh we gosh. put oh. to work over the summer and I always tell my kids at the orientation I have never seen a kid doing a drive-by or a robbery or something bad on their way to work yeah. and so <laughs> we want to yeah. make sure all the kids who are eligible and particularly kids who are from uh, low-income neighborhoods mm -hmm. kids of color who don't have the same opportunity right. as as white kids and if we look at the data the data says suggests that white kids are five times more likely to get a job than kids of color. So we push this. We try to make sure that we um, give them the opportunity to know what's going to be happening in the future, put them in positions. And I'm here this morning to say we need some more private sector uh, sites. I'm sure you have plenty of kids. Yes. Right? You got plenty, plenty of, kids. of kids. You need the businesses kids. to step up. Right. 2,000 kids signed up. Wow. And we, we only have the resources to support 1,000. So one, I want more private sector donors. Mm -hmm. I want more private sector sites. I want additional local governments to participate so that we can give our kids an opportunity to have an opportunity. What does this do for them in the long term? <laughs> I'm sure it, it lasts long past this summer. It does. It gives them a sense of pride. Uh, they put money back into the community. They're held accountable for, for completing projects. They know about what it means to have a work ethic. They, they're able able to network with different people in different arenas. And so I think it is just the best thing since, you know, sliced bread for me. Well, with yes. you doing the ask for more involvement, <laughs> I, I have a feeling uh, more kids will be helped because you're yeah. not going to stop at a thousand. Oh, I can tell all not going to stop at a thousand. In fact, I have an amendment in to, to uh, put another 500 on the streets for uh, 2017. You know, I was one of those Summer Works kids. I got a job when I came here to go to college at Oregon State University at the forestry department. And wow. I asked them, I'm a city kid from, from Grand Rapids. I don't know <laughs> what am I going to do here? Do? Yeah. And I said, why did you hire me? And they said, because you had high school work, um, you had work experience that I got in a summer job. Wow. And so I didn't know anything about forestry, but what I was able to do was to leverage that experience to get a job when I came here to go to college. And so it is, it has changed my trajectory. Okay. Well, thank Let's you so do it much for, for coming yes. yes. to our attention this morning. Absolutely. Summerworkspdx.org. Businesses yes. step up. That's yes. right. <laughs> or you'll be hearing from the commission. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Commissioner. All right. Thank you today. all for having me.